Adele. Girl, what you doing? What you doing? I'm giving you the side eye because I just don't know. I don't know. I, I have too many questions. Something, something is not adding up. If you want to learn more DIY hacks for your music career, subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to be personally notified every time we upload a new video. I'm going to tell you, okay, so I have the apology video. She posted it on Instagram or whatever. I have the apology video. We're going to play it, but I'm going to tell you right now, I have some questions. Girl, I have some questions. Let's just play the video. I'm gonna show y'all what what uh what she's talking. What is Adele talking about? Okay. Okay, so that is the official apology from Adele. A lot of news articles are reporting that Adele gives tearful apology. That they, they're saying they see tears. Did you see any tears? She looked like she had been crying before. Before the video started, but I don't know if I... I could say I saw tears. Um, let's look at this again. Let's look at this again. I want I want to show y'all this face. Hold on. Look at that face. Look at that face. Now I don't know if that's an apology face. Look at that. That's a face of someone who is about to have an argument or just got out of an argument or someone who is pissed off about something and they're about to. I mean, look at those lips. They're about to let you have it. So that doesn't really line up to me with the tearful apology. Something is off here. That's what I feel like. And I do have some questions like. OK, let me just tell you the background. Okay, so Adele was supposed to do a Las Vegas residency, a slew of 24 concerts. She was supposed to perform at the Caesars Palace Coliseum in Las Vegas. This was going to be a residency called Weekends with Adele. News articles are reporting that she was slated to earn, she was slated to make over 675000 per show. Tickets are starting, tickets ranging from like $65 on up to $685, depending on where you, you know, where your seat is. Y'all know how that goes. But, so she just canceled. She cancels this show, losing out on making over $675,000 per show. Okay? So she's saying that, She's citing that 
half her team has COVID and they had delivery issues. So those are my two questions. Okay, so if half your team has COVID, did they just find out that they had COVID last night? And so now you have to cancel? I'm confused about that part. So you just now testing people for COVID on your team? They just found out last night, all half of them, <laughs> just found out that they have COVID last night. But you also said that you have been up for 30 hours. So you've been knowing about this for two and a half days. Because you posted this on Thursday night and you said you've been up for 30 hours prior. So I'm just confused about the whole COVID situation. Now I know that it's COVID, that there is a pandemic, certainly, and people do come down with COVID. I'm not saying that they're not, they don't have COVID. What I'm saying is that y'all just tested the people last night or two and a half nights ago, y'all just testing people. Why did you have people on backup? You know, it's a pandemic. Why weren't people on backup? And then also the delivery issues. So you were going to have things delivered two nights before the opening night. You were going to have things delivered two nights before the opening night. That's cutting it pretty close, isn't it? I'm just saying, y'all, I don't, I don't know about all this. I don't know. Like, I understand things happen, but I think there's a lot more to the story. I do. I think there's a lot more to the story and things are just not adding up to me. Now, there are some other news articles that are reporting that... Adele has a reputation for asking for a lot, like in her writers, asking for a lot. They use this word. I hate this word, this this word, diva. She's acting like a diva. I hate that word because I feel like it's derogatory toward women because if, if men ask for a lot, there's not a word for that. It's not a word for that. Or is there? And I just don't know. I, I never heard of a word for a man asking for a lot what's considered too much. So that's just, that's a side note, okay? But news articles are reporting that Adele wanted to replace the entire sound system. The entire sound system. She wanted to replace that. She also wanted to replace the video mechanism for uh, for recording, for video putting it. You know how you go to the concert and they have the big video, the big screen, and they have the artists on the screen as well for people in the back. She wanted to replace that. But the thing is, is that the sound system is state of the art. This sound system has been used by other artists who've come before them. I think what Mariah Carey, um, I can't remember all the other artists, but other artists have used this same sound system and their news articles are reporting that she, Adele wants to replace that. And so they were just kind of, headbutting about that situation. I'm also hearing in the streets news articles that there's also some problems with her management. So I think all of this is culminating down to her um, canceling the show. And also, I did read somewhere else that she hasn't performed live in five years. She hasn't performed live in five years. So there could be a situation with, you know, being a perfectionist and having anxiety and just because she keeps she said, we ain't ready. The show ain't ready. I can't give you what I have right now. So that that sounds to me like she is expecting a certain level of quality that she's not seeing. And so that's putting her in a situation to cancel the show. But you know, there has to be a balance. You know, we're in a time of a pandemic. So, you know, you have to take precautions. You have to have people on backup. You have to be able to um, accommodate. You have to be able to have plan B for as far as del delivery, equipment delivery. You have to have a plan B. You have to be able to just go with the flow sometimes. And I just, I don't see that going on here. And I also see that 
Um, there could be the anxiety and the perfectionism coming into play here that's really stopping her from moving forward with this show. And she she is also saying that we're rescheduling will work. They will be rescheduled. I don't believe it. I don't believe that if what I'm hearing is true, I don't believe that they're the, these shows are going to be, these dates are going to be rescheduled. It's not, not, not at this venue, at least not at this venue. Um, these dates might be rescheduled, but it's not going to be at uh, Caesars Palace Coliseum in Las Vegas. It's not going to be at that venue. Um, I'm going to tell you why. Because if, if what the news articles are reporting is true, that they're butting heads with the venue, that venue is not going to reschedule her. You waited until the night before to cancel your show. That venue, you're not going to do these dates at that venue. There's Mark my words. If she does reschedule, it's not going to be at this venue. I, I really don't believe so. Now, if, if it comes out next year, whatever, she has this show at Caesars Palace, I'm going to get on here and make my apologies. But this is my prediction. It's, it's, I don't think that these dates are going to be rescheduled. And if they are rescheduled, it's definitely not going to be at that, at that venue. These venues, listen... They don't have time to work with you, negotiate with you, work with your team, try to get everything together for you to then go on and cancel the night before. It just, it don't work like that, especially in these times of a pandemic. It's just, it's not going to work like that. Adele, girl, what you doing? What you doing? I'm giving you the side eye because I just don't know. I don't know. I, I have too many questions. Something, something is not adding up. And it's just, girl, the night before? I just don't know, girl. I don't know. What y'all think? Tell me what y'all think down in the comments. Do you believe that her show is canceled because of the, okay, now let me not say cancel, girl. She's saying postpone. <laughs> She's saying her shows are postponed. Do you believe that she postponed these shows because of delivery issues and the pandemic? Or do you believe that it's something else going on? And if you do believe that it's something else going on, what do you think it is? Tell me down in the comment section below. Let's talk about it. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep it crafty. Head on over to thecraftymusician.com for more tips and tricks to level up your music career. Talk to you soon.